A dentist made a scatter plot below to show the number of cavities her patients had as it relates to the number of times they floss their teeth each week. We have a graph showing the, the number of cavities graphed against the, the number of times a patient flossed each week. And we have a graph that shows a semblance of a relationship. Now, we are asked to determine which of the following best describes the correlation of the data. Is it a positive correlation? Is it a non-linear correlation? Is it a negative correlation or is there no correlation at all? What to think about when determining correlation is that the word really means a relationship. Whenever you see the word correlation, what you need to think about is what kind of relationship relationship is occurring on the graph what is generally happening on the graph if we look closely at the graph if we look at each of the points the first thing that comes to mind is that the points are all scattered they are all scattered but if you look at the bigger picture what seems to be happening to the points what seems to be happening to the points? That's the key to analyzing any kind of scatter plot you have. What seems to be happening in general? And in this, in this graph, it seems that the number of cavities is reducing. The number of cavities is reducing as the number of times the patient flossed each week increases. This describes, this describes a negative relationship. As one, as one variable is increasing, just like the x variable here is increasing from 0 to 8, the y variable, the other variable, is decreasing from 7 towards 0. That is a negative relationship. Therefore, this answer must be a reflection of that relationship. So look at the answer options again and try to see which one talks about a negative relationship and that should be your answer choice.